Wildfires in the Russia-controlled Luhansk region of Ukraine killed four people, having spread to residential houses of the villages in three districts. Rescuers from five of Russia's southern regions came to reinforce local firefighters' teams. Several hundred buildings were destroyed and some industrial facilities were also on fire. Residents were evacuated from the area. Russian state TV RURTR aired dramatic footage on Monday showing houses and cars burned and entire village streets on fire. На данный момент сотрудники МЧС России по Луганской Народной Республике ликвидируют последствия ландшафтного пожара, который привел, как вы видите, к загоранию жилых домов. Поехали, поехали. Отвезем на хорошую машину. Увидит, сначала загорел, попытался что-то включить скважину, насос. Various cities in the Czech Republic were affected by heavy rain and flooding on Saturday. Czech authorities erected metal barriers or protective walls from sandbags, while water was released from dams to make space in reservoirs. Residents have been warned to get ready for possible evacuations. Some public events planned for the weekend have been cancelled at the request of authorities, including soccer matches in the top two leagues. We have to be ready for the worst-case scenarios, Prime Minister Petra Fiala said after a meeting of his government's Central Crisis Committee. A tough weekend is ahead of us. Meteorologists say a low-pressure system from northern Italy was predicted to dump much rainfall in most parts of the Czech Republic, or Czechia, including the capital and border regions with Austria and Germany in the south, and Poland in the north. Central Europeans are especially wary because some experts have compared the weekend forecast to devastating floods in 1997 in the region, referred to by some as the flood of the century. Over 100 people were killed in the floods 27 years ago, including 50 in the eastern Czech Republic where large sections of land was inundated. The biggest rainfall was predicted in the eastern half of the country, particularly in the Jeseniki Mountains. The second largest city of Brno, located in eastern Czech Republic, is among places that have not had flooding protection work completed, unlike Prague. Czechs were asked not to go to parks and woods as high winds of up to 100 km were forecast. Během chvilky, co jsem se bavil tady s místníma nebo něco, 
během 10 minut prostě šla hladina nahoru o, ne, nevím, o 20 cm. A... Tak uvidíme, to víte, že mám strach, co bude nebo co ne, protože když si furt bude pršet, tak na poli už se taky tvoří jezera, že? A kde to půjde z toho jezera? Bude se to rozlívat a to je to nejhorší, no. Tak uvidíme, no, co bude. Jo, 